everybody, how you doing? Welcome to new tutorial. In this tutorial we will make this little snail. Let's begin. First make a few circles. Chose the color you like, but for now I will use these colors. Once you've done that, now select all of it. Go to toolbar click on blend option, increase the value and hit OK. Now go to object then blend, then click on make. Let's draw our spline by click here on pencil tool. After drawing, now select both of them, and go to Object, and then Blend, then replace it to Spline. Now go to Effects, then Distort and Transform, then Chose Roughen, change the values of detail and the size, then hit OK. You can change the color of the circle size right click and chose isolate. You can add more circles, select the circle, then copy and paste it. Now let's make his eyes. Make a circle. Go to gradients. Change the color values. And another circle for pupil. Chose the color you like. Now add reflection. Select all and group it. Now let's make an eye lead.
Choose gradient and adjust the colors. Add shadow to it. Now replace it on top of the eye. Select all and group it again. Now make another copy from it, right click then transform, then reflect. Then hit copy. Then group them again, now add it to the character. Let's create his mouth. Adjust those two circle. Pathfinder then subtract it. Chose the dark color. Now go to Effect, 3D Materials, Chose Inflate. Go to Object and expand it. Now add some shadow to the mouth. Now let's create his ears. Chose the circle. To make quick copies, press and hold Alt on keyboard and drag it away. Now select all of them. Go to Blend option, double click on it then change the value. Now go to Object, then Blend, then click on Make. Pick up the Pencil tool again and draw Spline. Now select both of them, go to Object, Blend, then Replace to Spline. Now make another copy from it.
Of course you can change the color of your character. Select it and click above here on the color wheel and play with color. And make sure this is locked otherwise all color won't change at once. But I will leave it as it is. Now it's time to add a background to it. It's up to you what color and gradient. This was it again, please make sure to like and subscribe, more is yet to come.